yeah, it is it is just empty space. I think Seth and the EPs will be able to talk more a lot more about like the tech that went into it because mm-hmm. I know that they invented like a whole new proprietary system to make the shooting as like streamlined and easy as possible. Mm-hmm. But from our perspective, that didn't matter one bit because it was empty space. Yeah. We were looking at nothing. Seth would be off over in the corner doing the lines, which was very helpful, but it was it was tough to do for the first couple weeks for mm-hmm. sure. I mean, I loved there's a Halloween episode and I that episode is just so fun for me. I also really liked the Christmas one, but I really but the cool thing about Halloween was that we filmed it during Halloween, so getting to dress up every day in like a crazy costume and like makeup was awesome on point and like my hair looked different. It was just exciting. So it was because it was you kind of do the same wardrobe, same hair, same makeup every single day, so to have something switched was very cool. I mean, any chance that I got to do a little bit of improv was really fun, and there were a lot of chances to do that. There was plenty of space for that. In terms of things that really stick out to me, um, yeah, also the Halloween episode for me was very fun uh, because I got to huck eggs at people, like actual (laughs) real life people. I got to just beat them right in the head with an egg. Other than that, other stuff, like all the stuff with Clive the bully, uh, Jack Seaver McDonald was so great uh getting punched in the nards like 15 times in a row uh was you know distressing but ended up being really funny yeah honestly yeah getting punched in the balls really does stick out to me uh how vastly inferior us mere mortals are uh in comparison to him yeah like he is juggling a thousand different balls and wearing 50 different hats at any given time while also giving a really solid awesome performance that you can really play well off of yeah i think a huge thing for me would be uh the importance of you know preparation because i think we all came super prepared already but If you weren't, it would have stood out a lot because everyone came ready to go. He's so, you know, he's, if you're not prepared, he's already thinking seven steps ahead. So you're going to get left in the dust. You know what I mean? You kind of have to keep up and and know your stuff. And so that was uh, just fun to experience, you know? I'd like to see John get laid. I've said it before and I'll say it again. That would just be... That boy goes Poor through thing. a lot of hell and he could use just a boost, just any sort of boost yeah. to his self-esteem would be a good thing. Yeah. Um, look, I'll second that, the poor kid. <laughs> uh, no, um, I think that I would love to see a little more of Blair's personal life outside of the family. I think that would be pretty cool. Um, and her relationships, she's a very unique person uh, and I just think that it would be fun to explore uh, you know all more more of her personal day-to-day life.